What's good, yo? We back on TTV. Gang, gang, what gang. up? And if it's your first time here, definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill murder and smash that subscribe button. Yo, relax with that shoulder movement. You want to have the last time. Yo, check out that Patreon. We got early and full reactions of this show and a lot more shows, man. And also a yearly subscription. We'll get you a month for free. Check out the link down below. Yo. Yo when you get spilt. You just want to talk shit about niggas' shoulders. Shout out to my nigga Wells, yo. I mean, he make sure you give me. this video. <laughs> make sure, make sure you give this video a like and have that notification bell ring it for that Kuroko No Basket playlist and follow us on Twitch RTTV Five, where we react to some of your favorite movies, TV shows, and play some of your favorite video games. So follow and subscribe. Kuroko No Basket. Kuroko No Basket. All right. On the last episodes of Kuroko No Basket, we learned Learning. another side of Akashi. Mm -hmm. yeah. We went on a flashback, and the game between <coughs> Kisei and Kuroko's team is now over. Yeah. Kisei, man. Who's that? Koba, Koba Mabaru. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Kisei, man. Yo. That's a real nigga right there, yo. Jorge Yama. Jorge Yama. <laughs> Jorge <laughs> oh, Anime. Oh, man. I hope you guys watched all of our other anime reactions because you would get a lot of these references <laughs> right now. <laughs> and you, a future reference you will know is John Wall and James Harden. Yes. That's my dog right there. You're ready to go to real soon. Excuse me. <laughs> I was paid off. 50 bucks. I'll lose a game. Yeah, I paid off 150, so fuck Wow, it. you got better than me. Yeah, and my back hurt, so they they already knew I was about to lose. They still paid me. Oh, y'all y'all got any more excuses you want to pump out right now? Episode 64, <laughs> man. <laughs> what the fuck? Sorry. This is, this is when tune. the tomfoolery and fuckery oh, starts to begin. Yeah. I don't want somebody to get injured. So I'm on you, kid. I can't. I don't know if that was genuine or what. Which yeah, Akashi's such a mystery. You talking about his the, um, the other kids part or? Akashi? Yeah, he was like, "I'm worried about you" or whatever. Yeah, I was. Yeah, I, I didn't know if that was sincere or not either. <laughs> Yo, that dude be doing whatever. Mm. But he's right though. He's right. I ain't <laughs> worried about that. See, that's what he was wondering earlier, too. Like. <laughs> yeah, right? I just said I'm the coach. Why are you surprised I know your name? <laughs> he's like, nigga, I'm second string. How you know my name? Well, technically, now he's, he's first starting. Yeah. yeah. Would y'all have been heated if a freshman was named captain while y'all were varsity? If he deserves a place. I was going to say, if he's the best player on the team, <laughs> nah, no. If he's the best player, I've seen I've it seen was the that. worst player on the team. <laughs> Imagine he made the dude's dad get sick. <laughs> nah, that's some other yeah. shit. Yeah. <laughs> I, like, Why do I feel like he did? I had a snapshot and thought of that, but I was like, nah, that's old D, bro. Because <laughs> he's like rich. I'm, I'm sure he, he could do anything. Because he said that my dad was sick and he's doing better now, but who knows what's gonna happen during the nationals? You feel me? So he stood, he stayed out the, the tournament more just in case. So I don't think it's really that. I try to make him out to be a demon, bro. Hmm? Get people sick? Yeah, I'm like, nah, I can't give him that. What? Wait, what? wait, where the fuck did that come from? Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I think it was to shut them up. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Did, did his shoe fall off? Yeah, I'll, yeah. Oh, <laughs> you put man. your foot on my on my face with a sock on, man. That's fucked up. What the fuck? I see what he did. <laughs> what, did he, what did he do? I think I left it up he to Kuroko. Much, that's what yeah, yeah, that's what he did. He just left it up to Kuroko. <laughs> He knew Kuruku was gonna do that. He knew that that was gonna happen. There was gonna be a conflict of interest with Kise and Amine. Oh my god! Damn. Oh my god! That's my nigga right there, Duncan in the sixth grade. Is this one? It was like, yo, yeah. They said son. Well, that's gonna be a son, nigga. Facts. Yeah, I'm in the sixth grade. Hell yeah. He's going to be like six, seven. <laughs> what? <laughs> this is stringing together all the things that we've seen before. Like, this is like after like he had that game that he busted ass, but then he was like d- getting discouraged because like um, people they gave up. Yeah, because mm-hmm. the other team gave up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So you think they created that emperor's eye with like the information she's been bringing him this whole time? Hmm. I still don't get how you guys emperor's eye. Cause like he, they say he's been having her uh, collect a lot of data. Mm. Maybe. Data. 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 <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Like he's already lost the motivation. He was too nice, bro, at a young at a young age. But it's your fault. How? Cause he's the one. Oh, who's, it's Akashi's fault. Yeah, it's oh, Akashi's awesome. fault. Yeah. Well, this is his best friend, right? Nah, he's taking his eye, bro. Yeah. He looks like Akashi too, low. Yeah. <laughs> Shigahiro. We never. Shigahiro. 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 I forgot Kashi's last name. Uh, Shinju or something like that. Seijuro. Yeah, you like said that. what? Seijuro. That's this nigga's last name. Who's the one he just got off the phone with. Mm. I thought it was. Oh, and it did say that he was rich. Because if it's Shinjuro, Seijuro is the same exact last name of the person that he just got off the off phone with right now. Hmm. Good catch, though. If that's the same last name. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Akashi Seiju, though. <laughs> you can't beat me <laughs> this up, like. That's him right there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, even look at his eyes, bro. He looks like him, yeah. Is it the eye? I think so, bro. That one looks brown, though. Yeah, that looks brown. Like, Akashi's eye is like orange or some shit like that. Yeah. Oh, he's facing his boy. Uh, so this is going to be the Amine game, and then after that will be the Kuruko versus... Oh, game. that's a bad omen. Something bad's going to happen. Nobody can compete with him. It's fucking Amine, nigga. Damn. You niggas be calling him pack this, pack that. He packed niggas. <laughs> yo, yo, this is middle school. You know what happened right now. Yo, pack that nigga up, send him home. Damn. Damn. Ah, uh, my theory was wrong, man. He's so nice that he's sad that he's that nice because <laughs> nobody can ball with him. <laughs> no competition. Imagine being that good or something. Like, nigga, I'm so good. Like, I hate this shit how good I am, nigga. I'm so good, man. Shit. It's like Akashi drained their motivation. To work as a team and like, and the love for basketball. It's like he set himself up for high school though. It's like, yo, how can I drain them that I can get my dubs in middle school, but then when we get to high school and I'm separated from y'all, I can actually take dubs. Damn. We are no team longer. Damn. No longer, we bro. About to break up, bro. Damn. 
Like they did with Pippin and Mike, man. Then that he came. Shit. Look at the focus on him. He's just too good, nigga. <laughs> Look, he's apologizing. Yo, you know what? I should have catered to your feelings, bro. <laughs> Spilling, niggas. Damn. And the other team was up at half, I think. Well, what? What the kind of fuck? timing of. Jesus. Nigga, Kashi's a snake, nigga. Kashi's killing off anybody <laughs> in his way, bro. No way, bro. Nigga, he's doing something, nigga. I don't know. Everybody's sick, but they're going to be okay. Come on, bro. I see your boy, Jerry. I'm confused, though. Because isn't this middle school right here? Yeah. So aren't they the third years? Now they're third year. Yeah, they're going into the third year. Because they just like, won their second championship. That's why I was just, I don't know. Okay, oh, this, they're going into that third year. Yeah. Oh, okay. What? So he's talking his shit. <laughs> but he's probably a different level because he's probably had to restrain himself from playing. Mm. But that's a big motherfucker, bro. That's a tall bro. dude, yeah. bro. <laughs> if he's really playing against middle schoolers, just imagine. Need a Rima. He's like, can I make it from here? <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> like, no, Did I ask you if they was kids, nigga? No. This nigga is out of Fab Five in middle school. <laughs> His other eye changed. Oh, it's, it's looking no like it's changing. Like, yeah, yeah, like there was no. I thought his I thought his hair was just hanging in front of it. Oh, that's what it was. Okay. I thought that's what it was, but. Wow. They were poorly managed. <laughs> Nigga, they do that shit to Kawhi managed. right now. You want to come to practice? Come. You don't? Just go to the fucking Look, game. Karuku got a straight question mark next to his position. We <laughs> 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 like, don't know what this nigga could do. He's just on the court. <laughs> This one when I get fully shifted. Until Kagami came around, dumb nigga. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> that sentiment right there is what turned him into a It was Kagami and Kuroko. Don't sleep on Kuroko. Right, Rob? Pack him up. The GOAT, number two. I mean, number one. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm thinking about me and Nah, Pat, you know, you know, I'm number, number two. two. I'm number two, past one. Like Kuroko. Nah. Yeah, yeah. Pass Karuko, I'm Ka- Kaga. Kaga, me. Kaga, you got it. I know, I just didn't want to say it. The <laughs> Stanley ain't want no one on the name, so I had to. I, they got me. <laughs> yeah, honestly, I only listen to your stupid ass. I thought you could beat me. Akashi's like one on one right now. Akashi's about to bust his ass. And this comes from his family. Like, he needs to be good at everything, just yeah. like his dad said. Wait, this dude five. lives in constant pressure every day from his family. Well, I'll say his legacy. Yo, this coach can't control this team. Oh, oh fuck. Wait, Akashi lost? Yeah. So Your boy got broke up. whoop, Jerry. <laughs> Akashi, you lost, nigga. What's good with you? Nah, this is when Akashi figures out what he has to do to really be a savage. Oh, it's 4 0. It's 4 0, I think. Oh, wait, he didn't lose. So he's still going to win. He's about to come back. This thing is about to unlock his shot and gun, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> See, oh, yeah, I about told to you, unlock unlocked it. it. He lost his shotgun, nigga. It's like, where the fuck you going? Come on, man. You thought you could be Akashi? Yeah, look at his face. Oh, you're weaker than me. Uh, oh, my God. Akashi, I'm better than you. They ain't never seen somebody poke the ball loose? It was in that fashion. It was quick. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Drop. <laughs> <laughs> we started dropping this, Siéntate. nigga. <laughs> 
Come on, man. His thing yeah, is Evan, cheating, though. When I'm 100, percent that's what's gonna happen. <laughs> Not only the score, you're going to be on the floor, blocks, crossovers. When I I'm was, 50, percent I was 50. percent Nah, he's wilding. In, in yeah, real life, tripping. that's not a that's not a thing. <laughs> but I guess he took after. Like, like why his eye turned like that? I think he unlocked his fucking <laughs> internal fucking imperial eye. Like I feel like if the coach did the same, then it makes sense if Akashi followed in the same. Mm-hmm. He's like, nigga, I've been seeing that side of him. Oh no, I spelled differently. Yeah, I've, so ruled I get out, it. I've ruled out that theory of. <laughs> it, you mean the show ruled it out for you, or? <laughs> it make no sense, bro. The only one that liked winning like that was Akashi. Akashi smiling and shit. Yeah, that's crazy. He ruined all of them. Facts. <laughs> he made them all superstars. As kids. But it was a collection of things too Like the situation with the coach And stuff like that That definitely played a hand into it Yep Getting ready for high school buddy What? What the hell? He's the reason why he don't shoot Yeah no bullshit Yeah His jump shot was actually looking alright Niggas just violent and Niggas discouraged Real shit <laughs> Nigga looks crazy, bro. He said, I always had two personalities. The, the other, other took over. Took over. <laughs> <laughs> kind of split. I mean, the team did change before he changed, technically. No, it did. No, it did. Although, that could be true, but you can. I think you can recover from imploding. Yeah. It's like the way he's going about it is actually like decimating people's passion for the actual game and shit. Yeah. <laughs> Take it or leave it, buddy. All we do is win. All the rest of that shit, leave it over there. So that's interesting. Let, let's talk about that because I feel like what do you, what would you guys do? Let's say let me present this to you guys. You guys are in the NBA. Yep. Right. Um. You're winning. You won two championships in a row. In a row, yep. You know what I'm saying? And um, you're captain of the team. You see there's been some, there's some animosity in the team. Mm. Players ain't getting along with each other. I'll just say this. Yep. Players ain't getting along with each other. Is that, yo, you, would you implement a rule like, yo, just come to pra- Don't even come to practice. We'll just, just keep winning. Keep winning our championships. We don't have to be friends. We don't have to be cool with each other. We don't have, you know what I'm saying? None of that stuff. How do you guys feel about that? I, I don't. In the reality of it, had we been, we were in the NBA, like implementing something like that where it's like, hey, you guys don't have to go to practice because you guys are that nice. It just wouldn't work out in the long run because one, um, the chemistry, the, the chemistry isn't there. You know Talk what I'm it. saying? This shit is just, Kuroku is just so, this show is just so unhuman to where it's like, yeah, they're so nasty. Well, I feel like worse. in the NBA, it could really be that way because I'm getting paid if to you come to practice. five superstars on one team, team that mm. definitely could happen. Yeah, like, I mean, hell yeah. This situation could easily happen if there that was a situation. I mean, but like, even, tripping, if, I'm not even, even if they're getting paid, even if they're getting paid, if you're not practicing, you're going to fall off. I mean, James Harden wasn't coming to practice. He was dictating the whole yeah. Rockets team. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, but, still that, didn't but work that fucks for him. a team. That's work for him. Yeah, he doesn't. He hasn't won a. That's why that team no shit. win. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's what I'm saying. Like, I don't think I really think with Akashi. Akashi just he saw how they was acting and he just chose. You know what? I'm just gonna give up on these niggas because I just want to win. Like, I'm not gonna sit here and be like, I'm trying to be a friend. I'm trying to be this. Hey, we're winning. I'm not gonna try to force any type of relationship on you guys as long as we win because guess what that's the only thing that matters and it sucks because that's the ideal that his family gave to him like his family was like no you just have to win like just win are you doing good in school yeah is your basketball team doing um good yeah okay keep doing what you're doing that's it see that might my captain you are captain because me and you both watched the ron artest documentary and jermaine o'neill literally pleaded how him and ron artest did not get along at all did not talk had no type of chemistry. Steven Jackson came in and said, yo, when I walked in the locker room, these guys did not bond, did not talk, no nothing. So that's exactly how the NBA is going. And that's why some teams don't win championships. Yeah, yeah. And some teams do. So I feel like when you're getting paid money and you, you can perform at a high level like that, mm-hmm. it's 
very tough to make everyone get along. So this is why I fuck with this show because it's very relatable to the basketball world. From watching that's why I said it's possible. I said uh, it's possible for a situation of like something like that to happen in the NBA that has a lot of talents on one team. The fuck are you talking about? I never said there's no capability. Like that, that's not a real life thing. No, no, no. What I was saying, <laughs> I was coming at you because I'm saying you didn't give an example when you just watched the documentary. So that's oh, why because I, was I didn't give an you. example. Yes. Oh, you just okay. watched the documentary <laughs> I, that did yeah. that. No, that's no, what I'm saying. Like that's what I'm saying. Yo, Patrick. That's what I'm saying. Yo, Patrick. No, no, no. But he's basically saying, guys, when do you think in the NBA? And I'm like, you just watched the documentary where that happened. So I'm like, that's why. So I didn't say you was wrong, Patrick. I'm saying you watched something and you didn't state that, which you just watched last week. So I'm sorry, buddy. Well, my whole, well, my whole thing is this. Wrong, you, you definitely ain't going <laughs> to so win. So you did. You yeah, you're not going to win. Like, it, might work, it might work in middle school because like they're so far ahead of the other talent that it might work. Like We're actually that good. We're, nobody's even touching us. We're just that they good. They made it to the but, Eastern Conference Finals. So they were good. Who are you talking team. about? The, the team I was talking about. The oh, you're talking about the Pacers? The Pacers. Yeah, they were. So their team. No, no, no. But, but like, there's a difference, though. Like, yo, James Harden, like, put it this way Kawhi Leonard and Paul George, they say that's part of the reason the Clippers weren't good last year because they got that special treatment. And everybody, if you gave everybody that treatment, the whole team's going to slack now. That's not. That's, that's, that's that, exactly that's, the truth. That's I mean, not true because. That's the truth. No, no, no. But they were actually performed very well during the whole season. The quarantine is what made them um, go off. They actually were doing good the whole entire season. Okay, the, and people no, no, left in the, the offseason no, no, due to say, how that was. No, no, but I'm saying the quarantine is why they, they didn't play good in the play. They didn't even play good in the playoffs. They went to the second round. And I'm just saying the quarantine is why. That's not why. They, I don't think they were going to get it done. Everyone, Every team has special uh, things. If you're nasty, you're dropping 30, 40 points, man, you're going to be able to tell them what you can do, man. Yeah. And that's on every team. Even in high school, we see nigga Ron Artest. You've seen the dog, man. Ron Artest was beating niggas up. I can't. And they let him play because you're nasty. If you're that's nasty, bad. you could. That's on any team. But that's terrible like. for team chemistry. But that's, that's, every, that's, that's everywhere. That's a team, like, Every star player has a special treatment. Yeah, special yeah, that's, a yeah team. that's a that's everything. Any sport, anything, bro. If you think, you think Tom, you're the Tom Brady's biggest groupie. You tell me Tom Brady don't have me, special treatment me? in every... Yeah, you, Tom Brady don't have special treatment in every organization sure. he goes to. But I'm don't. i saying for anybody that I don't think is going to be beneficial to the team. Giving you special treatment doesn't help anybody. No, nah, but that's every team's. Like Akashi, is, has Akashi special like team. is a terrible leader. He's a terrible. But I don't, I don't agree with that because I feel like if he's dropping forty points, I cannot treat him like a nigga that's dropping. I cannot because he's because in my point, my so point. So I don't gotta like, go to practice. I don't gotta do shit. I didn't say it. No, I'm not, I didn't say that, my nigga. But if you're James Harden Obviously, and you drop fifty five points, man, and he don't feel like going to practice. Nigga, he's dropping fifty five points, my nigga. Like that. that sure kick I think they the team. The reason why they're treating you like that's because you're doing something that no one. I can't go to any nigga to come drop fifty five. I can't. Let me yeah. tell you this though. Let me tell you this though. This is a little different. If, they, if somebody said on my team, any team I'm on, yo, Rob, nigga. Matter of fact, nigga, don't never come to practice. Just come to the games, nigga. That's crazy. Like, I understand, nigga, skipping one practice. I, yo, I even possibly that. skipping a game. Nigga, you gonna skip every practice and come to the game? Get the but fuck out of here. I haven't seen never won a shit. It's fucking yeah. crazy. Yeah. Nah, 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 nigga, in high school, they used to be like, yo, nah, if you don't come to school, then, if you miss one practice, you ain't gonna play. Yeah, that's facts. And then, even huh? if you were good, even if you were good, if you didn't go to the practice yo, before Evan, the game, I'm telling you wild. right now, my nigga, we did not play in a school like that. If you're playing in a high school that's generating this much money, and you have a start, because you got you guys always forget it's a fucking business, and a start player is acting show. up, they're gonna do whatever they can to make him play, my nigga. It's more than just him, especially if they thought the bills, team was nigga. collapsing. Yeah, yeah, yeah like you yeah, niggas act like it's a business. They're doing it. Yo, the thing like that we understand, there's a teams that play to the core that never win a ship. There's a lot of people. The percentage of any player winning a championship is not high. So that saying, that saying, oh, because he's missing practice, he didn't win a ship. A lot of people that went to practice don't win ships. The percentage of winning a ship is very difficult. That's why everyone don't got one. But I can't say the reason that you wait, didn't win a ship continue, was because you didn't want to I just want to compare something that I've seen in the show that com- um, reminded me of high school, which I fucking hate. Like um, with Kuroku. Um, when a dude was um, in, in discouraging him to shoot, um, to shoot. Yeah. yeah. And the thing I gotta understand is that, like, yo, certain people I saying when you when you deal with athletes, like student athletes, their minds are very fragile. So you could say certain stuff. Cause I remember I always wanted to. Um, I was a football player, and freshman year, you play anything in football. They make you try any position. And I knew in my head, I'm like, yo, I was, I was, um, fast enough. But I could get faster to be a running back and stuff. And I told my coaches, I'm like, yo, I'm going to do track. I'm going to run because I know I could work hard enough to run. Niggas looked at me like, nah. Nah. <laughs> That's fucked You're going to go lift, weight, <laughs> wait, wait, lift, throw. You're not running. Like, you're not doing this and that. And 
my whole high school career, like, I always get heated about it because in my head, like, at 29 years old, how fast I got in, I'm like, I did that at 29. These niggas was telling me not to do it all during high school. So him, him seeing that and how it affected him is like, it really just triggered. And I think that's why this show is a really good show because that's real stuff that happens to high school or middle school players where you tell them something so young where they think they really might never be good at it when realistically they know their self more than you would know them. They know how they would work. So I feel like when I seen that, I, th- I that's why I thought you was going to ask. When I seen that, that's the scene that really uh, connected to me because I'm like, I, and the fact that he's my favorite character in the show is like, nigga, I feel you, bro. No, I, 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 I kind of feel that because something similar like that happened to me with track two. But I just told my coach, I was just like, listen, I, I really want to run because I just want to get in better shape. And she was giving me a hard time and she was like, no, you're going to be a weight thrower. And I'm like, no. I don't want to be a weight though. You had a choice. <laughs> like, nigga. I was forced like, to play power forward, like, my nigga. Bro, nah, but my even in football, no, in football, ass playing in football power it happened forward to me. In, high in football, school, happened to me and too. D1. <laughs> in football, it actually happened to me where it was like I played fullback my sophomore year. Like I worked all summer to play fullback. Tried to put me on the line, didn't get on the line. Um, what you would call it? Played fullback a little bit my sophomore year. I had two games where I did whatever. You know what I'm saying? Coach is trying to put me back on the line. I'm like, for what? Like I'm like I'm, I'm looking I'm looking at. I'm looking at my size. I'm looking at how I'm thinking about how fast I am. They're like, you're the fastest lineman on the team. I'm like, so why are you putting me on a damn line? I'm that small, right? Played line the rest of my years in my high D. school. A like, fullback? Not yo. Fuck in prov, in, in prov, in prov, fullbacks were not. Bro, that I was not. Like, that, if school, there was one position I didn't want to play, big, it was fullback. Fullback, you actually have like space between you and the linebacker. You gotta hit like you're taking hits every damn play. And yo, I feel like it was only because we had a freshman football team though. Like, mm. if we had only JV, I think we would have had a little bit more of a choice. But it's like, nigga, you got, what, 30 freshmen, nigga? It's like, mm. you're skinny. You can run. <laughs> uh, you, you're a little chubby. Go be a lineman. Mm, it's kind of right. like that. It was like, yo, this is how many players we have. We we ain't going to let you figure it out. Yo, if I wanted to be anything else besides, nigga, I was like, let me be a tight end. They said, run that shit. Then they said, Mezzo, run that shit. <laughs> yeah, nigga, you going to line. <laughs> it's like, well, that's how that went. <laughs> And I feel like for some players, like when you tell them, "Hey, you can't, you can't be good at the position that you want to play." Like for some, pl- not all players, yeah. like you'll play that position that you don't want to play, and you won't even. It's like I don't even want to play this position. Like, why am I even? So doing hold this? on. So do do you guys believe that in the NBA it is like that? This niggas on the team that are not friends they just come here for oh, the absolutely. paycheck. Oh yeah, for sure. Absolutely. How, more more than the people that uh that. Our friends? Yeah. I think there's an elite. That's, like, a, that's the real world. Yeah. yeah. I think that's in, in, like, even jobs. I don't think. Yeah, that's true. Corporate world, like, you go in and you, um, everyone's just friends. I just think that's just not, but when you're adults, it's just not how the world works. Yeah. Mm-hmm. If you fuck with somebody, you fuck with them. Yeah. yeah. And if the teams that do, salute to you. You guys are lucky. But it's like, we're lucky, man. Mm-hmm. There's people that probably do what we do and don't talk to each other, so. Mm. Now Salute. I'm sure it's like the young, like I'm sure the young teams, the ones who ain't that nice yet, they're probably all cool because they're trying to get that camaraderie to be great. But I'm sure like once you get on like a veteran team, I'm sure the young niggas is not best friends with LeBron James. It's just not like he probably got other shit going on. Like I'm already cool with Chris Paul, Lamel, uh, fucking Carmelo, all these niggas, man. I'm good. You want to see the ball fame and reality show? Um, when um Lonzo was on the Lakers team. He went to dinner with only like four or five people from the team. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure because it's the niggas who are more your birthday. age. Mm-hmm. You think? Nah, I wasn't even that. Was you think LeBron, LeBron want to do the things nah, nah, that Lonzo want to do right now? I don't now? think it's that. I just really, <laughs> I don't think his age is just yo. Do they vibe with you or they don't? Because yeah. Rondo was mm-hmm. there and Lance, they were veterans, so yeah. it just depends. Because like, just people just different. Yeah, mm-hmm. and LeBron has more of a. Uh, busy schedule. Yeah, busy schedule, and also like if there were TV crews gonna be there, was oh, yeah, LeBron right. actually gonna go to that? Nah, you right. saying like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, nah, you're not giving me all that show. Yeah, for free. <laughs> I fuck with you, but nigga, but I like. That. But like, have we ever seen that with like a whole not being friends? Like, just actually, yeah, you know what? Never mind. I forget what I was gonna say. I was gonna say with like a whole starting five. What well, they were all just nasty. Like, and I'm just asking this question because I really don't know. Like, with the whole start, like in the NBA, with the whole starting five, where there was bad nasty players and they all just didn't fuck with each other. Oh, didn't fuck with each other. Yeah. I think. You think the Cavs really fucked with each other at that time? What Cavs? The Kyrie. Yeah, LeBron. you think they fucked with each other at the time? Yeah, I Those think. Sad. I think after like, was, like after that shit was what made them not because mm, Kyrie yeah. felt like he was a leader at, after that. Mm. Yeah, I could agree with that. I'm I really don't know, yo. That team was kind of fucked up the paces. No, the paces. They didn't they, fuck, they with, each didn't fuck with each other like that. 
And they went to the Eastern Conference Finals. <laughs> and they had the best record in the league. I need to watch that documentary. Ron Artest, go watch that shit. <laughs> but yo, if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Nah. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash. smash that subscribe button. It's your boy Wells, the Anime King. What's good? It's your boy DC. Patrick RT. It's a man, the myth, maniac. Look and send the score RT. It's your boy Rob City RT, aka John Wall. You'll see real soon. And yo, that settles it at the, the round table. table. Drop that heat.